Hello, my name is Rich Howard, owner of Architectural Builder Supply, and this video is to bring you a closer look at the Carlson number LS702RH-Blue is what this is. This is a spring-loaded lift mechanism in a blue size right hand. Let's go over it. LS702 is the type of lifting mechanism that this is, meaning that it is mounted on the sidewall of the cabinet. Let's just say that for the purposes of this video, we've got a foot locker, okay? Uh, you've got a box with a lid. It's hinged in the back, and the, the LS702 will mount to the lid itself, and then it will mount to the side wall, the side of the cabinet. They have another model that mounts to the back of uh, wall of the unit as well. This is the side wall mount. This is an RH because when you're looking at this video, this is on the right side of the foot locker. If, uh, and that's how you hand them. When you open the, lot, the lid in front of you, lefts are on the left and rights are on the right. So this would be a right hand side. Now the blue is a reference to the color of the spring and you can kind of see there that it actually looks blue and it does. It's supposed to look blue. The color of the spring, therefore the size of the spring, or the capacity or capability of the spring is dependent on the size of lid that you are working on. There is a, and quite handily, there is a table that you can derive that information, but there is also a calculator down below this video called Determine Spring Color. And color means the size, uh, the capacity that the lifting mechanism needs to be ready to be able to handle. Okay, now having said that, let's click on a link below this video called Assembly of 700 Series. That is going to allow you to pull up a technical drawing of this item, but appropriately for right now, it's going to allow you to pull up the spring color calculation based on in what, what is determined, what's called inch pounds. Okay, so your 702 is sidewall mounted. As you see on that page, the 703 is the back mounted, LS703. Now, right hand side about two thirds of the way down it says to find inch pounds because in the table in the center of the page that's what you're referring to multiply half the distance from front to back times the weight of the lid weight of the lid let's say that your lid is 18 inch and it weighs five pounds 18 divided by 2 is 9 times 5 is 45 you're going to you will based on that fictional size and weight, you're either going to be at a maroon or a green color spring. That's it. LS702, LH or RH, dash color is how you will find the other sizes. That calculator down below will allow you to do that. And that's based on each of these as well, so keep that in mind. Um, some people, you, your, your lid's going to be hinged to the back side, so this is doing nothing in terms of helping hold the lid, it's just assisting keeping the lid up. So, let's move on to installation now. Okay, now, place the lid support on either right side or left side of the panel depending on the model that you've bought, or depending on the location of the U-bracket, that's the U-bracket. Using the dimensions on installation diagram, fasten the U-bracket to the side panel with two number six sheet metal screws. They're not included. Number six, you know, round head sheet metal screws. Uh, inch and a quarter from the center line of the uh, the horizontal axis of pivoting down to the center line of the screws. <clears throat> One and three eighths of an inch from that same center line to the vertical axis of this rivet that's here. Lay the lid support up against the underside of the lid so that the first screw hole is approximately three inches up from the uh, so that the dimension from here to the bottom of the lid is about three inch. Is three inch. Fasten with two number six sheet metal screws right there. Okay, it's your installation. The bottom of page one gives you the same logic based on 703 series, the back wall mounted. The second page gives you lots of dimensional properties uh, of the item, both open and closed uh, in its uh, behavior. I won't beleaguer all those points here. 
except to really just put a tape measure on the unit for purposes of this video so that we can you know at least do a reality check on the item there really are no dimensions that we can refer to based on this but we can kind of get an idea an overall height okay you're about five and three quarter inch center line to center line it's going to be about five inch or four and seven eighths thickness of this body about 11 sixteenths depth of the body about one inch okay this lobe that's here is what's going to compress this brass top portion to the spring to allow it to compress I really can't well I can do it a little bit with the hand because the blue spring is a lighter duty blue is going to be at the low end the 35 to 40 pound range so that's how that's going to work the balance of the extended description below this video self balancing lid it's going to stay where you want it to very nice uh, 702 rights or lefts are determined on the size keeps heavy lids from slamming shut that's really where a lot of this is coming from with installing these holds a lid open at any position available in either the statutory bronze which is this or black this color they call statutory bronze is the color that is by far most common and the only possibility of anything really being in stock meaning if you're looking for something in stock it would certainly be statutory bronze features a solid brass enclosure slide cover brackets riveted to the cam high quality spring available in different tensions and that's what the calculator is all about screws are not included this is a right hand blue spring overall length six inch they say base material is steel 35 to 40 pound rating and then the torque rating is the inch pound lid height divided by uh, or multiplied by lid weight divided by two comes back the same way uh, sold as each um, the supplier on this material will often send just um, these are always handed your sidewall mounts occasionally with the 703 they will send two right hands and the only difference really is the side that this uh, mounting bracket to the back wall comes down on um, that's certainly going to work if you have two right hand models of that I personally would want one of each so be sure to order one, one of each but for the 703's you can literally just order two of the same hand because they don't change in function at all based on the hand of the material finally uh, or getting close to finally there is a link below this video to the a document called mounting diagrams which just shows the 702 the 703 and then the 900 a fairly uncommon model just in terms of where they mount in the overall uh, assembly of a foot locker finally there's a link below this video to the manufacturers page where you can uh, pull up not only all of the Carlson products that we sell but a link to the manufacturers website as well if you have any questions on the Carlson LS 702 RH blue spring lifting mechanism or any other Carlson product please feel free to reach out to us thank you very much